Someone who's able to identify what are the important questions left to be answered. A sense of what's really important for us to understand. Someone who can really communicate. Open-minded. Looking for what's wrong. We judge them a lot of times by their publications. First, there's got to be the curiosity about uh, how people work. Uh, and that, that's ambiguous, and I mean it that way. One of the first principles of economics is we don't all do the same thing. You can be a good economist in lots of different ways. Today's economists are uh, so isolated. There's so much in an ivory tower. Looking outside of the scope of strictly economics uh, is important to answer some of the major questions that we're thinking of today. And some people might argue that the financial crisis and the fact that economists didn't pick up on it, you know, if, if we had been working together with other people, perhaps we wouldn't have missed this. Most economists aspire to an ideal where they can take economic theory and apply it to the real world in a way that makes the world better. Sometimes people criticize economists because they're too technical, they are too complex, but I really believe that it's important to have to use solid logic. Someone who can think clearly, write clearly, and communicate economics to someone not trained in economics. A mathematical mind is a great help. Um, but of course, the other thing that's a great help is the complete opposite. Creativity. Um, creativity in order to be able to think of interesting questions. But it's also someone who knows how to answer questions. So letting the data speak. Those are the two, two halves of the scissors that together make an economist. Keynes once said that economists should be more like dentists, but I actually think economists should you know, be more like engineers. A lot of us are indulging ourselves too much in the perfect little world where we are protected from a lot of assumptions we make. It's also easy to sell your soul and just to confirm the ideas that have been proposed by senior people. The problem with economics is that it gets politicized and uh, especially economists who uh, crave impact and uh, authority, they become members of political parties and that, that compromises the science. A good economist should have a very strong sense of responsibility for what they are trying to deliver to not only the policymakers but also to the public. It's like a, a doctor, like a medical doctor. Um, you know what's the cure, how to do something, you know what should be the right prescription, although it may hurt in the short run, but if it benefits people in the long term, you should do that. A uh, good economist has to write books and, and articles that expose the unsatisfactoriness of uh, what passes for economics. So one of my teachers told me that if everybody likes your idea, you can be certain that you've done nothing important. <laughs>